I'm very much uh, of the opinion, like, I mean, I, I generally enjoy playing games on higher difficulties. Um, but I'm very, very much of the opinion that that simply means that I enjoy playing games on higher difficulties. It doesn't speak to anything in terms of my ability with games or other people's abilities with games if they don't play on the same difficulty as me. You know, a game is literally there for you to have fun. That, that's, that's literally its entire purpose for being. So, you know, if you're not enjoying it, then something has gone wrong in, in that equation and you should fix it. And if that involves dropping the difficulty level, you shouldn't feel bad about that. People like to shame me for it, so cheating. I always feel like, I always feel like super like, uh, I'm sorry that I'm doing this thing, and everybody's like, Argh. uh, oh, I like it turned on auto aim in near Automata, which just makes the companion character shoot at things for you, so I don't have to manually aim it. I was like, this is <laughs> saving my hand so much, and everybody's like, how dare you? And I was like, what? Ah, it's a game. The people have fun. I'm glad I'm having fun. That's my opinion, anyway. No, I, I don't know. I, I grew up with, uh, did you ever play any of the Tony Hawk Pro Skater games or no, not really? Uh, no, no. I, I yeah. Didn't play any of the Tony Hawk that games. was one of the first games I've ever like played. Uh, and so I specifically, uh, I, I played tons of games before it, but that was, I think one of the first major games I sunk like an inordinate amount of time into. And that game had moon gravity. And normally Tony Hawk Pro Skater was kind of hard, uh, okay. especially for like a younger kid. And so it's just like, ooh, moon gravity, also like perfect balance. And so instead of, you know, actually having a difficult challenge, it was much more about like, what ridiculous nonsense can you do while you're flying around the stage? Like, well, you're on the moon. And uh, I was, I guess I'm not going to say quite uh, quite disappointed to find out. Well, I guess kind of. Modern games don't have as many, like, goofy nonsense uh, features like that. And I've been uh, kind of sad. But effectively, I, I grew up with... Uh, I grew up with a mentality of just like, yeah, cheats are totally fine because they make the game more fun. And so yeah. the older I get, the more... Uh, I'm actually finding ways to... I mean, effectively, I've got moon gravity right now. This is like the most perfect example I could come up with. Uh, and so, yeah, the old, older I get, the more opportunities I get to do that sort of thing. But uh, the more I realize not everybody shared that experience with me. <laughs> Again, I, I'm very much a, you know, you do you boo sort of mentality when it comes to, well, most things actually. Is the general my general state of 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 being? I'm yeah. Um, like I said though, you know, I I'll typically play games on on a higher difficulty because I I just I feel that victory tastes sweeter if I had to work harder for. Ah, I'm doggo lizard. Hello. Hello. Apparently, Hello. if you drop one of the fruits on the ground, that's how you make friends I'm with them. Hi, doggo lizard. I should have given you something. Hello. No, don't run away. You're stuck. You're a very, very adorably dumb dog, or lizard. Here. No? Ah, oh, I should have dropped it. Um, here. There you go. It's, it's, it's singing at me. Here. Dog or lizard. Eat more. What? Eat. It looks like it's eating. New email received. Text block. Oh. I think you broke something. Never mind. Doggo Lizard is happy. Uh, kind of. I don't appear to be able to... I... Oh, I can. Okay. Never mind. I can actually split my uh, food stack. Okay. Good enough for me. <laughs> One is over there like, what the hell is going on? I mean... I this is like the light version of whenever Shell finds an adorable animal, so I'm used to it. <laughs> uh, I found found a not adorable dog. What is it? Uh, this we one wants to punch me in the face until I'm dead. Ow. We have a bunch of new types of birds that we've never seen out on the west coast, and so every time ah. we're uh, we're out and about, she'll like spot a new one and immediately just start talking at it. So we'll be grocery shopping. I'll be like carrying like a 
you know, a bag full of tin cans. And I'll be like, Shell, get the door open. She's like, a crackle! And just, like, runs off. And I'm like, no! <laughs> yeah, that that is me. I'm not, gonna, I'm not even going to try to lie. <laughs> not even going to try to lie. That is basically me. Uh, however, I have discovered a problem. Okay. That, uh, yeah, I'm going to have to basically scarf down, like, 60 berries. Because well, when I put been... berries in my inventory, I suddenly had 77. <laughs> but I don't think they stack to 77, so it doesn't know how to let me take them out of my hand to put them elsewhere. There we go. I have now got my, my stun baton equipped again. Hooray! That was awkward. It doesn't seem to like dealing with things when... Uh, no, this, I, I mean, have... these, are, these are not yeah. official mods in the slightest. These aren't even... These aren't even really made for uh, multiplayer. Uh, I'm honestly surprised they even work you. in multiplayer. I thought I thought this was going to be a huge bust, but no, we're we're doing all right. Yeah. Uh, I think my sugar cube may have just left. Why is it <laughs> on sugar cube? Sugar cube, where are you? Um. The lizard doggo drove off. You see it later. How great would I, that be if the lizard doggos were intelligent and would steal your car? I, hmm. My sugar cube drove off and is now in a zone which is full of, of oh, poison gas and evil Did you leave flowers. the AI on? I may have. Yeah, I didn't I, mean I, to, but... I, I tried to warn you about that. I've run myself over with them before because the AI yeah. is just like... Well, they're not in anymore. Time to go straight. I'm like, what are you doing? No, stop. And then they just kick me out of the world. Yeah, that did kind of suck. I'm not going to lie. Not super happy about it, but okay. Uh, right. Okay. Well, I'm at the cold, the very least. I mean, yeah. Hello, evil beastie. Let me just like for cutie to death, please. Please die. There you go. I'm a, I'm a dingus. Right. <laughs> I just I found a I just cure. Cool, man. I just spent the Try last it. couple of minutes uh, making a bunch of biofuel, admittedly for free. But you know, it's like this is this is a. Uh, you know, I'll just kind of make a, a biofuel uh, setup while I wait for you to get the coal set up. Not realizing all I need to do is make like a handful of biofuel and then just dupe it a bunch until I had. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I made a mistake. Mm -hmm. wah, wah. Oh, wow. Lady Shelab has already got her key. Wow. From Key Mailer? Yeah. That's fast. Key Mailer generally pretty good. I. Yeah, I'm just surprised that the, uh, the coffee stain. Is not that that's a big deal. Well, I'm going she's to go welcome. Ahead and pop. She's welcome to oh, hop in if if she wants. I mean, this is a infinite person job, and how much more broken can it get? <laughs> that would actually be quite cool. Um, I don't know if she's got it installed yet, though. She might yeah. also not not have planned for it. I think she's still oh, uploading yeah. some stuff, but definitely. That's for next time, or if she get, if she is like done with the rest of her work, that would actually be pretty cool. All uh, right, okay. So oh, I gotta run power up there. here. Yeah, splitter. So who is this she lab? Uh, well, I've never actually spoken with her. She's raided me a couple of times, but I'm just always down for new people. Uh, but it's a Vax co-op partner slash housemate, right? Yeah. Yes. Wait, that's the wrong way, isn't it? No, no, it's not. Ha ha! I did it right! I am a genius. Still has some work to finish up. 
I would like to have a little go on it first, so he isn't a complete noob. Ah, that's 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 completely that's understandable. We we would be tossing her in at T. <laughs> it would be the quite deep end, <laughs> to be honest. The very very deep end. Uh, right, I'm gonna pop down a storage then. Okay, well, I've got coal being made. Um, there we go. The coal generator is now running the coal mine, which is then feeding into the coal generator and then into a storage point. So I can return here at some point with the required thingamoos to get this all running. So I now have that set up. Oh, some just went in. How did you manage to do that? Oh, there's many of them. Okay. Ouch. So many angry lizards. Oh, yeah. Got them all done. Uh, but yeah, the, the coal is now basically uh, feeding itself. And uh, at this stage, it is self powered. It's just going to continue to pump out coal. Stupidly fast into the storage. To be fair, this is actually oh good. You got a you got a storage is there as well. Now is it just yeah. one coal mine or are there multiple? Yeah, it's producing 120 a minute. So it's, it's producing two every, every second. Yeah, and, and there isn't a there isn't a second uh, coal mine in there. There there may be nearish by, but it's like another 400. I could have them all pulled together to make a a single area. I, I just know the, uh, oh man, our previous save was rad. It had four coal yeah. mines kind of down there. I guess actually, and my, my solo run ha has kind of a, a similar thing where it's just like a silly amount of coal all stacked in one very small area, making it much easier for me to go do everything. There we go. I just upgraded those belts to level 2 belts, simply so that it can move 120 coal per minute. Yeah. Seems reasonable. No, I think that's fair. Especially because we're going to have to walk back and fix it eventually anyway. Let's see. All right. Okay, so this little area is self-powering and is stockpiling the coal. I'll go and set up a one other coal mine that we can then um how far away is it it's 300 meters away i need to make sure there is actually a viable route to it though for a a sugar cube to take because th this one is definitely viable but the other one ooh, no it's cross -pointed. i could build a, a bridge over there but mm. no i think this is going to be the one that would like just one for now unfortunately I don't know. It doesn't seem to be a, an easy way to get there unless I build a massive concrete construction to give it a path. Oh, do you have to, like, go up and down something? Uh, across a, a ravine. Well, actually, no, across a massive river. Oh, I, oh, wait, 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 wait. There may be a land bridge. If there's a land bridge, I'll go over there and I'll set the other one up because as long as I can give a sugar cube a more or less flat even path to the location if i can do that then that's fine yeah yeah it actually looks like that. it'll work come on then you look like you're a boss version of the other one you super angry with me no you don't appear to be super angry with me okay fair enough. oh you lied you lied oh my god that was a very very long way you just punted me bye how rude did you find like a boss charger yeah. Now I so need to eat like into 70 of bits of, of fruit. Because it's the only way that I found. Uh, 
Let's see, out of curiosity, if you like uh, really hard games, are you going to be playing Sekiro or not? Not really. I'm considering it. Definitely considering it. It's on my radar at the very least. A lot of things come down to, am I going to have time with all of the other things I want to do? Oh, there's, there's never enough time, actually. Yeah, no, there, there's not. There's always more I want to play. So it really does depend on just what, what it lands around. What else is like going on? I think it's coming out on Friday? That was kind of where I was. Oh, wow. Uh, let's see. Not exactly this with this game. Oh, actually, kind of. I was... Uh, so I'm going to PAX in a couple of days. And mm -hmm. so I was trying to think, like, okay, am I going to have enough time for everything? Uh, you know, how big is my backlog going to be for, for satisfactory? You know, am I going to have to do a second session? Uh, mm -hmm. Then I played, like, nine-something hours yesterday, and then obviously we've played... We've been going for four hours today for co-op, uh, which isn't half bad. I'm wondering if actually some of the lag we're running into is just all the uh, particle effects coming out, out of the smelters. Because uh, it's got a lot laggier now that I've got this running. Oh, no power. Um, let's see. Oh my lord, I'm being attacked by four... Shard. I may die. I found uh, our version on this save of the uh, mega coal deposit. Oh, did you? Is it... It's suitably mega, yes. Yay. That's right. Chargers, you all stay down there. Thank you. Please allow me to kill you. It's only fair. Please let me kill you. There we go. That'll do. Ouch. That hurts. I'm very low on health. That's right. Just leave your bum there. See, I want to tease your behind. Right. Do you know what the normal stack for veg uh, for fruits is? It's like fifty or something, maybe. Uh, no, no, they stack up to a hundred or more. Mm. For some reason, really I just cannot. I cannot take any it out of my hand if I put it in there. I. It's probably entirely my fault. Uh, we can probably turn things off fairly soon, actually. Ooh. Might need to. This is super difficult to. Uh, if you can get the, uh, if you can get the coal mine going, I will try. Because I actually almost shaking. have. I almost have the. Uh, there we go. The setup over here. I may have killed enough of the aliens now. But yeah, I found um. A couple more coal mines altogether, so yeah, I should be able to get this going. This is a normal one. This is also a normal one, but there's two of them right next to each other, so it's probably worth setting up. Yeah, I've, I've almost got the uh, the iron and screw production going at this point. Oh wait, oh, I'm dumb. Well, yeah, it looks like uh, it's actually all the animations are creating weird lag for multiplayer. Could be it, honestly, yeah. Wouldn't be too surprised. Because I'm noticing now that I've got all these constructors down, uh, the game has gotten a little choppier. Not too much. Not nearly as bad as our previous one, but a little choppier. There's no reason why I need to make this completely even. I'm going to be producing way more coal than I need, so just this. Get a merger. Yeah. 
he's produced 60 a minute, that's more than enough. Second coal mine is done. I'll just drop down a storage and then we're good to go. I'll then go and make the actual stops normally because that is not something we had in the last one. Yeah. There we go. Right, so uh, the... The... Both, uh, both of the coal areas are now set up. And I'm going to make a new tra um, sugar cube because I'm super lazy and I don't want to have to walk all the way back. And this will also show me if I can get back normally. Okay. Driving back. Okay, I'm pretty happy with what I managed to set up there, actually. We'll probably need more than one sugar cube to make this run because these things are going to be generating quite a lot. I'm glad that the sugar cubes can just run over stuff as well, though. That's actually pretty good. You mean oh, like I wonder. Uh, enemy animals or plants? You oh, think, I mean, yeah. as long as it's not a tree, this is plants that'll run run it down. But I wonder if uh, the charges will attack the sugar cube or if they only attack players. That would be an interesting one. Uh, let's see. I've, I think I actually did a test with that. Um, they don't. I think they just straight up ignore uh, sugar cubes because I think I was parking myself on top of one of the fire guys, and he was just taking it. Okay. Because I I vaguely remember like cackling about how they couldn't do anything to me because. You know, obviously, they're giant inconveniences. I don't know if you could do damage, though. Well, if they can't do damage to us, I, I would feel it was unfair if we could do damage to them that way. True. But if they just flatly ignore the sugar cube, if there's no person on it, then I'm, I'm absolutely okay with that. Okay, I am almost back. And it's a fairly uh, simple route. Sugar Cube should have no trouble moving from one one uh, location to the next this way. Alright, I think I've got the iron production going fully. Excellent. I guess I'll go get a very quick copper chain going. And I am basically home. Welcome back. That was, that's actually pretty cool. If this works, I'm going to be really chuffed. I'll be really, really cool little setup, I think. There we are. Oh, you've got everything powered. Wow. Yeah. I, I made a bunch of bioreactors, and I filled them with illegitimate means. But oh, no, that's fine. Again, we lost so much, it feels completely fair. Um, but yeah, um, I mean, this bridge is there to allow us to cross, but we could just have a set of coal power plants just down here where the sugar yeah, cubes we... would drop off at. Uh, yeah. Because initially I was building this bridge so that we could move the sugar cube to the other side because that's where the coal line was, but realistically, there's no need for that. We can just have the sugar cube drop things off on that side. And then... Um, yeah, there shouldn't be any problem with that, actually. Thinking about it. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm just going to tear this concrete structure down, then. Don't need it there, since we can walk around it fairly easily.
Ah, no. Oop. I think I just deleted a power line. Um, actually, no, it doesn't seem to have disappeared. All right. No matter. Yeah, if we get uh, the basic copper up and running, then we are more or less back to where we were before. We can just turn off the inventory cheats and uh, the production cheats, leaving the jumping on, and then we're good to go. I'll probably still build with, with a mind to if the jumping wasn't there. So I'm not going to make things... I'll, I'll probably approach this like, like I do in Terraria when I'm playing with someone and it's like, yeah, now that we've got grappling hooks and all of this and like boots that negate falling and all this kind of stuff, it'll be super easy to build with that in mind, but then we'll die and we won't have it and it'll suck really badly <laughs> when we're trying to get anyway. I usually just, uh, oh God, I'm either, yeah, I'm usually kind of a nightmare when it comes to, uh, Specifically when it comes to Terraria, I kind of bum rush for the magic mirror if I can get it. And then I'm oh, just yeah, like, yeah. uh, what's safety? <laughs> right, uh, let's go and have a look at Wanda, what Wanda has been building. I think that would be wise. Super wise. Let's see. So I've got most of an iron setup going. I still have to get the assemblers, but that's something we should probably get. Yeah, that's something that we should build um, afterwards. Because you, you'd built everything that you've got here, you'd already built in the last game. I mean, it might be a little bit little bit more expansive than before, but uh, no, this is, you know, this that's, is, that's basically just grinding. This is everything yeah. I've, I think... I might have oh, like one or two more. I I think the main thing is just the uh, the giant mega structure in the sky. But well, we had one of those. It was just like yeah, different. no, exactly. I don't feel like personally. I don't feel that we've given ourselves anything more than what we had to start with on this. Um, and that's why I want to build the sugar cube stations after the fact. Yeah, sort of once absolutely. the cheetah had turned it back off because that is not something that we had. But like the the copper and things like that, we we absolutely have already. I mean, if it's like one or two chains more, eh, it, it's neither here nor there, really. We were just starting to build up towards steel, um, so we should probably unlock up to that because that was kind of a patch to make. Though that being said, if we've got all of this production already, then possibly not as necessary. Oh, cool. Uh, yeah, uh, kind of hurt a little bit. Let's see. Yeah, I can st I can start working on steel. Steel's actually really cheap, so I can oh, really? just do that uh, while you work on the sugar cube factory. Hi. All right. That sounds like a plan. I'm just gonna go and hook well. up the uh, the remaining parts of the iron production. Or does that lock up the whole thing? Uh, are we don't... producing enough power right now? Uh, I think it's fine. There we go. The other mines are engaged. And drilling. Okay. Right. Well, I'm going to uh, take a moment's break and just go uh, grab another drink. And then when we return, uh, shall we knock the cheats off then and get to building yeah. new stuff? Awesome. Yeah. All right. I'll be right back then. Okay. So where is he? Yeah, we can make sugar cubes. Okay, so I'm I'm let's go find where Avac is. Well he is Oh right. I shouldn't be jumping too much. There he is. Oh no. He actually parked himself in the least sneaky place. Hmm. 
Okay. Alternatively, damn it. Wait, I have other solutions. Okay, Tony, you can come in. Ah, dang it, he's coming back. All right, Hello. you didn't see anything, nothing happened. Literally just came back to <laughs> roarous laughter as a tractor flew off into the atmosphere. Wow. Wow. That was glorious. So many sugar cubes. Oh my lord. see what would happen if... Because, you know... Oh. Oh. Oh no. Well, I am dead. Oh. Apparently that lake has false water. Ha! That's what you get! <laughs> you scallywag! <laughs> You've gotten your just desserts, I would say! Oh, that is absolutely oh, just desserts. Are you still there? Did nothing yeah, happen Yeah, I'm you? fine! <laughs> Things just, just bounced off my head and I saw a sugar cube flying off! <laughs> so, I was trying to figure out how to mess with you, like, without, you know, obviously doing too much. Um... Because I can't help myself in somebody's, like, AFK in a game I'm playing. So I usually, like, <laughs> surround them in walls or who knows what. Uh, so I surrounded you in sugar cubes and found out that they actually have no collision with each other when placing them down. As long as you can see the ground. Right. So I just started uh, mashing as many sugar cubes as I could possibly generate into an area uh, to see what would happen. Because I was hoping I could, like, almost fuse you with a truck or something. But no, no, instead I set off a sugar bomb. Yep. Yep. The bomb was good. It was good. I was not expecting it to work out that way, but I am pleased with the end results. <laughs> I decided that it looks a bit monkey if we uh, ah. have it like that. So I'm going to just build this all up so that these conveys go to this, the right place. On the right level, that is. Yeah. Yep. Yoink. Because we want her on the top level, don't we? So that it can be... Yeah, we want uh, one for iron and one for coal. On that belt. I don't remember why we had four levels. Uh, I... Two for copper, one for coal, one for iron. Oh, limestone. Limestone's on the bottom. Oh, limestone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Sorry, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Ah. Okay. Well. Alright, okay. Time to say goodbye to the, the glorious, glorious, like, like, cheats. I'm gonna yep. completely keep what's in my inventory. Not even sad. That 60 reinforced iron plate, justified. I'm just not gonna add any more. Okay. Let me know Let's when the cheats see. are off, and I will go about building things. Uh, Cheats are... Cheats are off. Hey! Right. Except for jumps. Okay. Yeah. That's yep. Fine. Okay, so. Truck station. Either send or receive resources to vehicles. Has an inventory with 48 slots. Transfers up to 120 stacks per minute to from docked vehicles. Always refuels vehicles if it has access to a matching fuel type. Seems reasonable. So. Okay, how is this going to go down? Oh my lord, this is pretty bloody gigantic. 
Oh, the truck stop? Yeah, it's huge. Ah. I'm gonna have to make sure this can go. Right, I'm gonna need um, the. Modular frames, only ten of them. There you go. Okay. Let's uh, hi, Legio. Abak, why cheat when you can just analyze milestone and build jump boots? Uh. Wanda doesn't have it and, and is quite attached to the ability to jump very high. Uh, as I've said, I, I take it or leave it, but are, I are there bend me Are there the jump boots? I'll, I'll turn it off if they actually exist. It's just I have yet to hear of any any non trolly uh Yeah. Hyla said there's jump boots at the very least, so I alright. I my jump boots. So what did they say to analyze? Uh, analyze. Hmm. I don't know. They they they've got a comma there. So it's when you can analyze, comma milestone and build jump boots. So I'm not sure on that one. Uh, Hila, let let us know in chat what we need to have a look into for that. I I know there's a jetpack, but the jetpack is something completely different, and I don't like the jetpack because I. Do you ever have that in games where, like, the moment you get, like, flying, it just feels really unsatisfying? Uh, yeah. D I definitely had that kind of effect in, in Terraria. Yeah. The moment, yeah, the moment actually, ability was no longer a problem, it was like, well, that's half the game gone. Because I, I really like the, uh, I really like the running, the jumping, the climbing aspect to it. And yeah, the moment you get wings, it purely... The game isn't really even meant for wings, from what I've experienced. Like, it's very much a... It, like, almost breaks down a little. I can remember trying to, like, dodge around things, and it did It just didn't feel right or good. I need cable. Oh, Hila says... Can't remember whether it's a milestone or an analysis. Um, well, the only thing that we really want to have confirmed for us, Hila, is whether it is jump boots or jetpack you're talking about because if it, if it is jump boots then we I, I imagine wanda would be quite happy to work towards that but we're just not aware of those things existing all right take all store i, I guess i can them. always google it it's not like i'm incapable of doing so uh why are you not making cables you're not getting wire why are you you're not making Copper ingots. Why are you not getting any copper ingots? Because I never told you to make copper ingots. There's their answer. <laughs> 